And we have to look at the newspapers. And, um, well, my wife is thinking she will see all the news about Adele and the Grammys, etc. Mm -hmm. and, and Adele, mm -hmm. after winning that uh, best album, uh, thoughts that, well, her mentor and somebody she admired, Beyonce, should have been the one who won the... Uh, I, I disagree, actually. But, you know, out of respect, sometimes you say some of these things to make people feel good. But Adele's album the last year was great. Yeah. It was great. Title yeah. tw just 25. Not all the long talk albums. And she had 21 we before. Yeah, she's had 21 before. <sighs> all right. Uh, so hopefully we'll, we can get some of the pictures. Yes, we and will. Hopefully we get videos as well when we do online. Uh, but let's do the core papers. The daily graphic newspaper is what we start uh, with. Free SHS begins September. President Ekofuado uh, saying that. And Roland, I think Roland gave me a reminder that this is the first time we've had free SHS, free SHS, but this is the first time that he's put like a timeline to it. Yes, there's and a timeline to it. Yeah. And then the it's been itemized in terms of what things will be free. Look, everything's going to be free. No computer yeah. fees, boarding fee. For real? No, I'm telling you. The, the teachers will I wish that my children were, were, were old enough to enjoy all the... But listen... Or all the goodies of these times. I tell you what, I am not confident about an all-free school. And, yeah. and, and I, I don't know. I hesitate. Don't, uh, I, I wouldn't take my child to an all-free school. Well, it's SHS, so... I know. <laughs> it will be difficult... Yeah. Because Charlie, free things. Charlie, then you, you're picking with Ghana International. Free things. <laughs> but Roland, you have a conversation. You know, be, on you know, this, be fancy we won't yeah. on that <laughs> so, You have a conversation on this, uh, on the on education. Yes, we do have. We have a great conversation on the subject, and uh, we're bringing all the brains who really are connected to the to this. A former director general for the Ghana Education Service, Michael and Soa, will be joining us, and uh, we'll have great conversation with uh, those who have a lot more to say about education. Please yeah. stick and stay. Please ask them. I, 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 I get scared about free things, free yeah. SHS. OK, well. Uh, today is Epilepsy Day, and we have a conversation coming up. I'll be at the Kolibu Teaching Hospital later this morning uh, to have some great conversation. But there are also a lot of concerns, really. Uh, later on, when we get there, we'll tell you all about it. Uh, also on the front page of the Daily Graphic, Bimbela now ghost town. Eight die in accidents at Ewusijo Methodist Church will not compromise beliefs, according to uh, its presiding bishop. Uh, let's touch on this accident on page 20, uh, an accident that killed eight people, sadly. Uh, and it says that... Eight people died in a gory accident when two minibuses collided at Ewusijo near Agunankwanta in the Ahanta West District in the Western Region last Saturday. Some of the passengers were said to be returning from a funeral in Takradi when the accident occurred. More than 21 others who survived are said to be unconscious and receiving treatments at the Fianquanta Government Hospital in the second day Takradi Metropolis. The victims were members of the Church of Christ, Takwa. Tanoso branch, who were returning to Takwa after attending a funeral in the central region. The dead were the driver and seven members of the church. Oh, gosh. Uh, finally, the Methodist Church will not compromise beliefs, uh, and the presiding bishop of the Methodist Church, Ghana, the most reverend Titus Awachipats, has given the strongest indication yet of the church's determination to revisit its partnership agreement with the government if the latter fails to enforce the values and tenets on which Methodist schools were founded. And in that speech I listened, uh, this was uh, uh, some celebration uh, that the Wesley Girls High School is actually the 180th anniversary speech and prize given day of Wesley Girls High School in Cape Coast last Saturday. And I listened to him, uh, really, really strong words there. Uh, and I tell you what, the church will not sit back and lose what they've nurtured, you know. They founded those schools, and now if it's turning into something else, they've got to take their schools back. Uh, let's quickly do the back page of the Daily Graphic newspaper. Mohammed's uh, Brace Wednesday for Kotoko, Bechim, Pip MC, uh, Alga. This is not the main league, right? This will be something else. Oh, uh, given the home side, a winning start in the 2016-2017 Premier League season. Oh, so the season has started. 
Yes, it, it did. Over the it, it started week. like how? Nothing. I think that is more like the 2016. <laughs> is it 20 what? This is 2016, 2017 mm. Premier League season. And we're starting it in 2017. Oh, Charlie. No, we're... I didn't even know the league had. Okay, well, that's it. That's the it just started point. last weekend. In 2017, two months into 2017. No noise about it. Like, there's, there's nothing. There's no... You, you can't feel it, No, right? nothing. Yeah. Nothing. Not like premiership. They take the cup round. They do all sorts of things before ah. the league starts. We were here when the, even the Emirates <laughs> Cup came, came here. here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what a GFA we have. Well, let's look at um, Ghanaian Times. On the front page, we have free SHS begins September 2017 and president declares. Did you read some of the things that will be free? No, I oh, didn't. didn't. Not quite. Anyway, you... It I, spells out the things that will be free. Yeah, definitely a okay, story. Go so ahead. let's go to page 60 and get some of the things that will be free. You know, they say there's no free lunch. This one is free lunch. Um, let's look at some of the things that will be free. Mm -hmm. ha. By free SHS, we mean that in addition to tuition, mm -hmm. there will be no admission fees, mm -hmm. no library fees, no science resource center fees, mm -hmm. no computer lab fees, Fees, no examination fees, and no utility fees. No complex hey, parents. fees. The parents go no and handouts your... fees. Hey, that is me again. Why didn't you? But are they going to be... 20 years ago well. when I finished school, you know, I should, I should have been enjoying this. No, 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 no Roland. I, I tell you what, until certain other things are addressed, I am not super confident in this fee. The policy will also cover not only senior high schools, but also cover agricultural, vocational, and technical institutions at that level. What times are they going to be disbursing the money so that the schools don't suffer because the students are not paying anything? It can be done. <laughs> no, it's not easy. Nobody is saying it cannot be done. But can you handle it? Can you handle it? it After all, the children are our children. We have a responsibility towards them. It can be done. Already. Well, but this is going to be very costly and i'm sure your guest will tell you huh. front page of the ghanaian times we have coach ade passes on and of course we told you the story about um, the, the accident uh, that, uh, that occurred around the usijo and eight parish in that very gory accident on the back page we're told between united beat to algerian side only two when they were celebrating they will go to algeria and go and see on three four deal and uh, apparently he was 71 coach samade he was called the multi-system man. He won the under-17, I believe, in 1991, and then 1993, I believe. Uh, one all-star stand by al Hakli and uh, Kotoko overcomes Liberty. We have uh, the sporting team coming your way with the latest highlights of the 2016-2017 league season, which has started uh, last year by the starting two months into the new year. <laughs> we have the Daily Dispatch newspaper. It says NDC provides the details of 643 vehicles, seven ambulances, four motorbikes, and two tankers. I see. Average age of MPP ministers is 55.5 years. And then we have um, other stories there. So those are the stories we have. Mm. I've got the Finder newspaper, and something just caught my attention. Uh, that's marriage before 18 years is a crime, uh, says Action Aid. Uh, they're given some figures. Uh, so I'll just skip what's on the front page, just quickly go to page five. And it says that uh, the records indicate that 700 million women were married before the age of 18, while 250 million women were married before the age of 15, with 15 million girls being married every year before their 18th birthday. If you're a man and you marry somebody who is not 18, it's a crime. The law will deal with you. Uh, let's go back to the front page of the Finder newspaper. Economy deteriorated in 2016, according to the IMF. Uh, presidency vehicles, is it 678,006? Uh, no, is it 678, 641, 426, or 218? Are they answering the question or they are just asking us because different numbers have come out? Uh, okay, well, so the paper is just reiterating the, the points that different people have made. So, for instance, uh, it says that the attempt to clarify the issues led to disparities and figures raising more questions than answers. 
678 Administrator General David Yarrow has publicly stated that the immediate past government documented and handed over a total of 678. And then it says, a head of logistics at presidency. Uh, on the other hand, a document handed over to President Ekofuado's side of the transition team by one Suli Abubakar, head of logistics at the presidency in the former administration, indicated that there were a total of 426 vehicles at the Flagstaff House. And then it comes back and uh, it says that to make matters worse, former Deputy Chief of Staff in the Eswal uh, uh, Mahama administration, Mr. Johnny Kofi Osei, provided a list of 641 as the total number of vehicles handed over to the Ekofuado government by the Mahama administration. So which is which, really? In this confusion, the Ekofuado government said it meant only a total of 218 vehicles at the presidency. Out of this, the Ekofuado government said 173 are serviceable and 45 abandoned at a place called Kosovo in a completely shattered and uh, broken down states. So the back, back and forth is still ongoing. Uh, the final newspaper puts it in proper perspective for you, tells you who has said what in the final newspaper. Uh, also, West Blue provides shelter clinic for Kayaye. That's some good news. And the free SHS story also on the front page of the finder. Day student to enjoy free meals. Add this to your list. These students will enjoy free meals. The feeding to his part. Yes. This Are you is, sure? Yeah, that's what it says. Okay, let me go to page five. No, but that's what it says. Uh, so, fresh day students. students. This is this is the angle of the finder by Daniel Nono in Ekropong. Fresh day students who would be entering senior high school in September 2017 would not only be the first beneficiaries of the full implementation of the much-touted free SHS policy, but also have a rare opportunity to have a free meal at school each day. Quotes, by free SHS, we mean that in addition to tuition, which is already free, there will be no admission fees, no library fees, no science center fees, no computer lab fees, no examination fees, no utility fees. There would be free textbooks, free boarding, and free meals. And day students would get a meal at school for free on quotes. A quote from the president. Okay. You believe in free? You believe in free? You say? You believe in free? Yeah. <laughs> we have business and financial times. On the front page, we have financial stocks lead market revival, certain tone for bullish year, and we must explore BRICS. And BRICS is um, the nations of uh, Brazil, Russia, India, China, and South Africa. You know, after the G8 and all the G7 and all, and all those things, those who that come who, who come below are uh, said to they are part of the G20. Or, um, we should all be made aware, and um, uh, they're, they're huge markets. Look, billions and trillions of dollars in those markets. Financial stocks level market revival. And uh, we have new mining activities boost gold production. And we have other stories there. Back page, Golden Link opens to provide tailor-made products and uh, five uh, benefit from other um, things. And uh, for Vodafone, etc. So, now, I'm interested in the Grammy, so. Mm. That's for me, straight away. <laughs> today, can we do CNN and go to entertainment or something and yeah. get some pictures? I think, whoa, whoa. Can we do CNN today? Let's see. Okay, so... Um, can I just read something to you that apparently uh, uh, Ayukwe to posted on his Facebook page concerning this, the, the, the missing the vehicles, vehicles of, you mm. know, whether it's missing or not. Mm. And he says, my attention has been drawn to numerous reports about missing cars with the media expecting me to disclose what my committee discovered. Yes, I was chair of the executive asset subcommittee of the transition team. My committee did our work within our remits or terms of reference and presented three reports, an interim, final, and a sequel to the final report. Having presented the report, I do not think it's appropriate for me to discuss the content thereof in the media without authorization. Kindly, therefore, direct all queries to the appointing authority. I thank you for your understanding. Huh? 
hasn't given anything away. Uh, so, you know, there's back and forth, back and forth. Uh, I have also been saying that what was handed to the transition team, because there are the people who can tell you what, because, you know, the, when you give them something, they were not just supposed to take it on the surface of it. They were supposed to cross-check, uh, you know, with what was on the ground. And, you know, I equal to uh, head of that committee that was in charge of assets where the vehicles would come under. So a lot of people wanted... So that's what he said? Yeah, he says we should... He's I not mean, clarifying he's, anything. No, then. no, he hasn't clarified anything. He just... He just uh, but, 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 out. but you he's remember what I said on Friday. I, I kept saying that if you have to undertake a certain communication, you have to make sure um, it is not ambiguous. Okay, because no matter it's a it's a polit it becomes a political communication yeah. tool, and so people will punch holes and try yeah. to find uh, expressions or meanings in the narrative in terms of what your expressions meant, and try to analy analyze it phrase by phrase, sentence by sentence, paragraph by paragraph. So you have to be ready with some questions that you've already answered. Yeah, it's true. So when they come, and they will definitely come. Yeah, you know, it could be true. It could not be true, but no matter how, what it is, just be ready for it. Yeah. Otherwise, you leave these gaping holes. And, and because these, the media is not only mainstream media, and um, the political communicators would not become um, extra defensive when some of these things are thrown at them, because then they are in government, so they can't do a lot of other things. Yeah. It, it's a very difficult situation, I believe. Well, let's go to the entertainment. Um, what are you going to what entertainment? Yeah, page of CNN. You want, okay, there. you want to talk Gram Grammys? Yeah, so let's okay. talk Grammys. You know Adele, okay. I love her. Adele, Adele is a British singer. Yeah, Hello. Has, has this uh, size fourteen uh, size and, and sixteen is this, size. This is fourteen. I think she looks more like sixteen though. But she she keeps um, going in and out of the weight so. But she, she loves uh, her body size, and I, I love her body size, so I think she looks great. And she won big at the Grammys. Yeah, but this is red carpet. You yeah, wanna, the red you carpet. You want to look at red carpet? Well, we can look at some of them. And, and, uh, <laughs> we'll, we'll, but let's look at the mainstream issues. We have, hey, <laughs> sister. <laughs> There's eagle beneath the... Uh, he said you want to look at pictures. Uh, <laughs> and now you're running away from uh, the Next one. <laughs> Oh, oh <laughs> the one who acted was in Powers movie, I believe. Next one. Ah, you actually want to be looking at pictures? No. Uh, well, some of the red carpet pictures are not bad. Oh, great. Another one, too. This is who? Uh, one of them. Seriously, you don't know who this is? <laughs> who is that? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know? I don't know. <laughs> I know Adele. That's Beyonce's sister. You don't know her? Uh, Solange or something <laughs> like that. Uh, Solange. Oh, okay. Oh, Roland. Charlie, Charlie, let's next. close this page. Let's do the news. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So let's go on to the next. Okay. So let's go mainstream. And uh, Mama, we will go to MajorOnline.com. Okay. Yeah, we'll do MajorOnline. Uh, let's skip this first one. Let's move on to other issues on MajorOnline.com. MP uh, demands national security intervention to stop distraction of farms by illegal miners. Uh, also on the page this morning, road crash claims eight lives, leaves 21 in critical condition. Uh, there are some photos mocked abandoned how 16-year-old struggles with um, neurofibromatosis. Okay, uh, and this is a story that's been told in pictures. Uh, please find time and look at it. Law forcing Auditor General to recover misappropriated funds passed a campaign by Occupy Ghana to get the Auditor General to enforce its powers to, requ uh, to recover misappropriation of public funds has yielded success. Uh, more men in Ashanti region becoming hypertensive according to uh, the Ghana Demogra Demographic Health oh. Survey. Can it's we read? revealed a disturbingly high prevalence of hypertension among males in the Ashanti region. Why? High prevalence of hypertension. Is this the geography, geographical area? So those between the ages of 15 and 49 were found to be prone to abnormally high blood pressure. Kumasi Metropolitan Assembly Health Director, Dr. Alberta Brichum Nyakon, said men in the region, quote, 
are 10 times likely to have the disease than males in the same age group elsewhere in the country. She made the findings of the survey known at the annual health performance review meeting held in Kumasi. She could, however, not tell what was making more men in the region increasingly hypertensive, except to say that further research was being carried out to determine the cause, whichever way this is uh, disturbing. I remember we've had a, a, a conversation, this high blood pressure thing conversation here on the show. It was very revealing, by the way. You know, it leads to several problems. Uh, it can lead to a heart attack. You know, you Don't can certainly die. It can give you kidney issues. You know, like it, it links to a whole lot of things in your system. Yeah. <sighs> All right. Uh, I have a story. The, on thing, I, the, the thing I love about uh, Shanti is that they can eat fufu at 8 p.m. It's great. Could it be, you no, know, no, no, a I'm not contributor? <laughs> I mean, you can get a joint or... A, they just love their culture. Yeah, and, yeah. And, and they can eat fufu at... Uh, I think sometimes culture is good, but you just have to... These days, lifestyle issues have become yeah. a thing for many humans, and, and we can, need to... Can I tell you my experience? When my first year in school, when I went to Zion College, you know, I had to live with my grandmother, Mrs. Victoria Nyomi, in Angloka. And my first few days, like, every evening was banku. Ah! And the ba <laughs> Heavy. And the banku, Before you go to sleep. Banku was the dry, you know, like in Accra, we used to... Like the, the conjo and the cassava do, like ah, the, the other one. one. Oh, the, so it was it was new to me. I didn't like it. I kind of fasted, even though I didn't pray for three days. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I, I don't envy you. At so all. that's the culture. You have to eat apple, and then you know that you've eaten. Yeah. yeah. I guess in the Ashanti region, you, you have to eat, you have to eat fufu. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Let's look at this. Uh, well, President also tried to introduce legal instrument to back new ministries. Uh, have you read this? Uh. Well, okay, I'm sure Member of Parliament for Wa East mm. has charged President Kufuado to speedily introduce a legal instrument to Parliament to back the new ministries he has created here. Uh, this was said on Friday in mm. Parliament. Uh, I think it was uh, 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 Yile Chire. Ye, uh, ye, Yile Chire. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, so let's go to CTFM. Uh, vetting of regional minister nominees begins today. How? Oh. Uh, ben Black clashes medical staff abandoned posts. Sam Ade was one of Ghana's most brilliant. Uh, may his soul rest in peace. Uh, this is uh, according to Nane Kofuado, by the way. Uh, ben Black schools closed down over clashes. Uh, that will be it uh, for the stories on CTFM online. Let's end uh, with BBC and maybe we can look at some more pictures because Rola wants to see. Uh, <laughs> uh, Angola Stadium. I did. Say I wanted. To, I wanted to see the no, winners. This is an old. This is okay. This is tenth of February. This Angola old. Stadium Stampede. Uh, how do you pronounce this? The winners. The, the name of the. So we have the winners now. 17. Let's go to the winners. Okay, at least okay. seven people have been killed in the stampede at a football stadium in the northern Angolan city. It's okay. Uh, and you know when it's they were okay. when they were talking it's about this story, idea. they had to talk about other African countries that have experienced. And it was really not cool to hear Ghana. You know the. One hundred and twenty-seven. Yeah, exactly. The they main nine stadium story. disaster. Some incident happened in Egypt. You know, and yes, now yeah. here. Uh, okay, so we Roland's been talking about the Grammys, uh, winners and nominees. So there were 84 categories at the 2017 Grammys, and here's a list of the main winners and nominees. Mm. All right, Roland. The good thing about the Grammys is that they don't ban artists. They don't ban. They actually don't ban their best artists from participating. <laughs> More like Ghana. <laughs> Uh, so Ghana, uh, they banned the best artists from participating. So this is and I was the mediocre ones. Album of the year going to Adele. And yeah. then he said that for his album 25, he said Beyonce, uh, yeah, you Lemonade. Know, the, should the, I? You know, they were in the same category. And yeah, she, but and I, she disagree. Thought, I disagree. I yeah. disagree. I totally think no, no, I, Adele. I, I think that she was being politically correct. You know, thinking that, you know, she, she was winning the thing on the whole side of America. She's like a modest yeah, person. Yeah, yeah. She's yeah. always a modest person. But these are really, like, and this is a yes, tough, this yes, is a tough group. group. If you because look at the last year, Justin Bieber's uh, purpose, And even Drake. Yes, Drake, Drake's yeah, Drake. uh, views on point. But, you know, I think Adele, too. nobody would, would query you on that. No, not that. Hands not, down. Not, not at all. Okay, so record of the year. Also Hello, again, going uh, to sweet. Yeah. And then Beyonce also had great, great, great song in formation. Do you know these guys, uh, 21 Pilots? 
<laughs> I'll pull one of their songs for you to listen. They are like they such a big bass. Are they? Uh, Almost like they can do anything. Right. Like a two-man band, kind of. <laughs> oh, great. And then we also have Song of the Year going to Hello Again. Wow. <laughs> wow. And I, I love uh, Justin Bieber's uh, Love Yourself. How about I, I Lucas Graham Seven Years? Um, I love that one, Once too. Once I was seven oh, yes. years old. Yeah. And then we have the best new uh, new artist going to Chance the Rapper. You know him? No, I don't know Chance mm. the Rapper. So let's move on. Okay. <laughs> so we have uh, the best alternative album going to David Bowie uh, posthumously. Uh, sometimes when you die, you are awarded well. But uh, on the charts and uh, on in sales, the album also did well. At least almost like um, the Thank You album, so to speak. So the best pop album also went to Adele. Yeah, Adele. Wow. I mean, I mean she, she, won, she won big. Wow. Okay. Uh, the, the Chance rapper again, Coloring Book. Mm, and now we have the best album. rap album. And Chance the rapper won, of course, but we had in the category De La Soul, we had DJ Khaled, Drake. Uh, you also had uh, Schoolboy Q, but we're all familiar with Kanye, Kanye West. And even though the, the reviews were saying that uh, he didn't do too well during the year, but that's not, that's not, that's not, that's not true at all. Charlie, but people He's will be nominated. so heartbroken, yeah? Because yeah. if you look at the best, best pop solo performance, <laughs> Adele is here you again. Know and Beyonce says, hold up. Like, hold up is nice. Yeah. You know, hold up? Yeah. 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 And then Love Yourself. I mean, Justin yes, Bieber's yes, Love yes, Yourself. Yes, yes. If you come down to Ghana, this is like mm. a very famous song yeah. in Ghana. And then we also have the one by Arena Grande, uh, Dangerous Woman. It's also a yeah. very nice music. Wow. Okay, 21 Pilots also winning, mm. stressed out. Best dance record. Oh, some of them just don't. Uh, 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 don't Let Me Down, don't. The Chainsmokers. Mm. You know The Chainsmokers? Yes, I know them too. Okay. And then we have uh, Best Dance Electronic. This is Asokbo, the Asokbo. The one we call Asokbo in Ghana. <laughs> the British love Asokbo off. Okay, well, you know, uh, this is, I, I, I heard they went a bit political. Uh, We're talking Donald Trump? Some people made some political statement here and there. Uh, but it wasn't as strong as like the other statement that people had made. They, they, uh, they had made at the, at the Oscars, at, at the for Os instance. Yeah. At the Globe, uh, the Oscars have not been held yet. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. The, mm. That's the, the, the movie, like the TV, yes, yes, yes. whatever, whatever. The Globe. Uh, so, best urban contemporary album went to finally Lemonade, Beyonce. Mm. Okay. Well, so Adele is like the biggest winner, yeah? Mm hmm. I think she deserves it. She does. Oh, finally, All her albums Hotline have been... Blink also wins something. Best rap uh, song performance. And then best rap song. I agree. Like, who am I, really? But I agree. <laughs> and you know, in America, eh, the songs that, like, make headlines in the charts are not the ones that we kind of like. Sometimes you hear a song and you're like, who are these people? But they're, like, huge, huge. in America. And Europe, yeah. yes. Oh, uh, best musical theater album, The Color Purple. All right, so more and more and more, you can check them out. All right, we have so, to bounce. Mm, we have to bounce. We, ha we have to get off stage bounce, and make way for the sports team. Yeah, uh, but still ahead on our show, I take off and I go to Kolebu teaching in the hospital. We're talking epilepsy. Mm. Uh, and uh, doc I'm, I'm speaking to Dr. Akpalu at the Kolebu teaching hospital. Uh, and we're, we're, we're having a conversation at the epilepsy clinic. It's not a clinic solely for epilepsy. There are other diseases related because, you know, it's... it's and uh, when we're preparing for this, we had to go there on Friday. And I was just so heartbroken. Just so heartbroken. I think we need to take... We need to look at Kolebu again. We need to look at Kolebu again. Because sometimes you look at sick people and the environment that they are seated really and they're coming for healing in an environment that is totally not one that when you look at it, it can even give you some kind of healing, even before you're treated. You know, really, really sad. Lots of people. This was around what, what time? Uh, before 10 a.m. And the queue was long. That's massive. I was wondering how, how, be how long. Yeah. And if you look at the consultancy, the rooms where the doctors even consult, it was more heartbreaking because you look at it like a cubicle. That's some supposed to be a premium hospital. Room, yeah, some small room, and it takes two doctors and two patients. So if I have a personal, 
like disease, you know, you know. You want to have some private conversation. The next patient, I'm just like sitting behind. My back is behind the next patient, and the doctors are facing each other in some small like. Oh, it, it's really sad. But we hope that we can put the spotlight on this. Uh, mm, and, and, and especially uh, since we're giving everything free now, we we'll hope that at least um, we'll have enough to cater for some of these yeah. things. Uh, that's the uh, most critical of the things that we need to do. Yeah. And, th and that's what our concern is, because then we'll not have enough to do regeneration, mm. kind of rehabilitate and put... True. Yeah, because uh, everything you know, is going to Kolebu, welfare, welfare, for welfare. For all of us, for all of us, Kolebu is our last stop. Kolebu is the last stop. Oh. When it gets really critical, Kolebu is like Actually, the last we're stop. We're told that when you get have to you Kolebu. visited the emergency uh, um, place before? I have. Charlie, man. And you know, when I stood there for a while, I thought, like, where are the rich people in Ghana? <laughs> and then I was told, oh, they jumped the queue. I was like, listen, you can jump the queue, but push some of your money into, you know, rehabilitating the place. Jump the queue, all right, because you know we know that you know all the big people. But put some money there. I mean, sow some seed there. Adopt like you know a floor or something and fix it. Oh. It's really depressing, very depressing to think that it's the last stop for all of us. I'm be so emotional we this morning. We're also having a great conversation. Is my project. We're, we're having a great conversation on another project, um, but this one is a project of the president, President Ekufuado, and announced. Free SHS fully, not partly. And um, we have to go for sports. But before we go, we have to do a special money moment. You know, uh, Friday, I couldn't contribute well. Uh, I was broke that day. <laughs> no, you were not. <laughs> it's not my for you to, to be broke. You tried to pull a fast one on me. Oh, it's a... And not, I remembered not, over not the light. weekend that so you didn't put Friday it in. Friday and today. But this is just symbolic. Mappy for me. Okay. So it's just <gasps> for you to make sure that... Uh, for real? For all the things that you do... Um, you are in a position to put your money somewhere. <laughs> and this one is going for holidays. So at the end of the year, I want to go for holidays. So Roland, I'm keeping my money. Thank you. Thank you so much You're for welcome. paying for me, you know. Don't twice. worry. Don't worry. Yeah. Like, pay <laughs> for me every day. Oh, that would be great. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be doing that all the time. Stay with us. We've got sports coming up next. We'll be right back. Mm -hmm.